Hello everyone and welcome back to my kitchen and my channel. Today I'm going to do Indigo Neely's recipes for her egg crepes and the egg wraps, kind of like the egg life wraps. She figured out, genius, congratulations, thank you Neely for figuring this out for all of us, how to mimic these wraps because the egg life wraps are a little on the pricey side. So she figured out how to do it. I am going to do them for the very first time. Never done them before. So will I succeed or will I fail? Come and see in just a minute. With every star, we are born again. Open your heart. Spend this time in your head. All right, to start, I'm going to turn my 10 inch crepe pan onto medium, put that on there. And all of the ingredients or any of these tools will be down below in my Amazon store if you wanted to look into buying those. The first version I'm gonna make is her crepes, which is a half a cup of egg whites. Put that into a bowl. Then you're gonna sprinkle one tablespoon of gelatin on top of that. We're just going to whisk in. It's gonna bloom while we're whisking. I'm gonna add some coconut oil to it. You could do melted butter, bacon grease, whatever you wanted. Let me see if it's done. That might be close enough. I put it on medium high. Medium was not doing enough. There we go. Let's see it's kind of goopy and drippy. Oh, sorry, heater came on. This seriously is about to take the entire thing of eggs. Now, while that last one, this little small one, it, I did turn it back down to medium, is cooking. I'm going to start the next one, which is the Egg Life Wraps. This is a quarter cup of water plus one tablespoon. The one tablespoon of gelatin on top of that and let it bloom for a few minutes. That did not take long. That's all nice and chunky now. I'm gonna add in three tablespoons of egg white powder. Try to get that all evenly mixed in. And that'll fall out. Oh, I forgot to respray it. This guy is done. Oh, yep, yeah, he's stuck a little bit. Now I'm gonna respray and do these ones. I'm gonna try to do half and half this time. Last time I put too much in the first one. Okay. That one is still a little bit shiny, but I think it's done. This over here. I think I'm gonna turn this down a little bit actually. It looks like it's 
pretty warm. I turn that down to medium low. These ones thicken up a lot faster. So you gotta kinda try to spread fast. What's funny is that Neely said no matter what she does, hers don't brown and mine are getting brown. <laughs> It's too funny. It must be the coconut oil spray. Now, while that's cooking, I'm going to do another experiment. I don't know if anyone else has done this. I'm going to take two whole eggs, which is just under a half a cup. Because sometimes you don't want to do all protein or protein, you know, with little fat. Some people like me need the higher fat. I'm going to try this and see what happens. So I did two whole eggs. I have no idea if this is gonna work. You may never even see this. Now, one tablespoon of gelatin. Let's see what happens. Alrighty, I think that's pretty much done. I'm gonna pull this guy off. Alrighty, spray. It's thickening up now. I'm gonna pour, try to go for about half of it. All right guys, I gotta hurry and finish this video because the kitchen is needed. So here are all of the different, my Play-Doh crepes, the different wraps that I just did. The first one was hilarious because it's huge. It's absolutely huge. They're paper thin, I mean, extremely thin. I didn't realize how thin these were gonna be. This is the one that is the fresh egg whites and the gelatin. Neely uses these to make like chimichangas to put stuff inside of it, wrap it up, you can spray it on the outside and then crisp it up in your air fryer to make a crispy wrap. She also uses these ones for a sweet crepe in the morning. So I have one and a smaller one of that one. These are the ones that are made with the egg white powder mine actually did brown up hers never do so i don't know if it's the coconut oil that could be what it was but they did brown these ones are definitely firmer like you can see where i'm holding my fingers and it's staying upright so i could have i might have overcooked this one a little bit that is that one and then my two inventions with the yolks they are somewhere between the two. <laughs> the texture, the, the flexibility is great. And then they're a little bit stiffer, but not as stiff as the other white ones. And then they're thicker, so they definitely do flex more. Okay, I'm gonna have a taste of all of them. Ooh. That was the first one. It almost doesn't have any flavor. There's a tiny egg white flavor, but there's almost no flavor. It's just so thin. Okay, this is the more like the egg life wrap. Mm. Okay, I have to say I like these so much more than the egg life wraps. Like seriously. So much better than the egg life wraps. The egg life wraps have kind of a funky aftertaste. 
These are fantastic. Oh wow, that's really good. Okay, now, last but not least, the one with the oaks, because I like to have a higher fat content. They are definitely stretchier. No. I honestly was expecting an eggier flavor, and it really doesn't have an eggier flavor at all. So, if you want a higher fat, then go ahead and do the yolks too, because that that is really good. Keeping the higher protein, leave out the yolks or bring the yolks in. Either way you wanna do it, uh, I say that these are a total win. Thank you, Neely, for figuring out to use the gelatin. That is absolutely the secret ingredient. So guys, go try these. If you have not tried these yet, I will link down below. There'll be a little section for the crepes and go give them a whirl. And then let me know what you decide to make with them. Thanks so much for checking in today, guys, and we'll see you on the way. Bye. Oh, the cupboard's open. That's bad. Shut the cupboard. It's a little off center. It's better. Okay, now it's shaking. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel and my kitchen. Today, I'm going to do Indigo Neely's recipe for her crepes. This is not the one that's exactly like the egg life wraps. I do have. Maybe I'll do that too. Should I do both of them? I don't know. Yeah. And I need to finish this while it's hot. Okay? Okay. Can I have like five minutes to finish? Okay. I was like, I didn't even realize what time it was. I usually never start this late because I know you have to go to work. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, you can come in now.